Hi everyone, welcome back. So I know I haven't posted in a very, very long time and I get so many nice messages and people are asking me, um, you know, if I'm good and everything. Everything's good. I'll do a live one of these days and I'll let you all know what's going on. Um, but today we're headed to the grocery and I thought I'd take you along. Um, we're going to Walmart, so I'll show you what they have and I might spread this out over a couple of days. So I'll go to a few different groceries and I'll show you my little grocery shopping for the week because I go to different groceries to get different things. So keep watching and thank you for joining me on my journey today. So we finally got to Walmart. It's just about 10 minutes from the house, maybe less. And um, I'm wearing my Trini mask, of course. And um, thanks to Hilton for this. He got this from Soka Passion here in Texas. So now I'm gonna go into Walmart and show you. So we just got in the store. And Kevin just picking up some salami here. Apple cinnamon brioche. Brioche. What is it? Apple cinnamon brioche. If you all follow my Instagram, you know that Kevin is highly obsessed with bread. Anything bread. <laughs> They have sweets here and on this side, lots of desserts, cakes, all different types. This looks good. Decadent chocolate cake, red velvet, cheesecake, carrot cake, banana pudding, all kind of different things. And they have ice cream cake here, cobble ice cream cakes. More dessert. And this is as soon as you walk in. And the fruits and veggies are right there. Cookies. Shrimp. And only in the south you'll see alligator nuggets. 1344. Cajun style breaded alligator nuggets. Oh look, they have dunk. What is this one? Last time we saw goat, but... Oh, yeah, but they have it. Bone and goat. So they have uh, burger patties here. Beef burgers. I just picked up some cream style corn because I'm feeling to make a corn soup and I um, actually made some over the weekend but I made it for a party and now I'm feeling to make some for me um, so yeah I didn't really come here to pick up a whole set of things but um, I just saw the corn so this is the bacon section and I just have to get some sprinkles for barfi for Diwali cashew flour let's see powdered peanut butter almond flour gluten free coconut flour cassava flour dandan gum okay. so this is short name good for pastries and stuff but if you're using this it's better to use lard so they have this non-fat milk. I don't know if this would make it, you know. I never tried it with non-fat. They have coconut water here. I'm not showing you every single thing, but yeah, they always have like their own brand of almost everything. Kind bars, I love these. They're a little bit on the pricey side, but they're so good. So this is the cereal section. The only cereal I really eat is, let me show you, this one. Honey bunches and I usually buy it in Costco. Two big um, boxes. I forgot the price but we usually get two together. And there is Mr. Kevin. And they have oats and stuff here. Syrup, I really love this one. 
long cabin. And I love Emma's homemade maple syrup. She actually mailed me that uh, a couple of years ago. We needed to get some cleaning stuff and this section is always dry since COVID. Um, see if you see it. Oh yeah. Oh, you take the last two. Yeah. Look at this whole section. It's dry. Look at here. Try again. Oh, they do have shaman. They have a whole wine section here. I've, I don't think I've ever really went through here, so I'll show you all a little piece. They have these little party cups for shots. Um, they have beer here, cold beer. More beer. So they have all kind of different drinks. Apple. I'm sorry if I'm moving really quickly and you can't see. I just haven't vlogged in a long time and now I'm back and I need to get used to it again. I do love this pure leaf tea. I usually get the one without sugar and I like the hibiscus one. So it's like two days after Halloween and look they already bring out all the Christmas stuff. This is the pet section. All the pet stuff. Hey. Kevin. I saw some food there for you. Some pet food. Did you need some pet food? For dinner? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I tell him he needs pet food and he tell me I need that but I always go crazy over the baby shoes. Look how cute this is, oh my god. So tiny. So we are in the workout section. This is what I really came for. Um, um, yeah, so Kevin's training me these days. And um, <laughs> so I need to get some workout clothes. I don't know, I'll show you all what I choose. I'm just gonna look around a little bit. Look at this. These are two dollars, but I don't see my size. Okay, this one is a four six. Um, I could work with this. I could just pull the string to tighten it. Kevin choosing out all, <laughs> all the pants for me. He always does this. I just stand up and he does just choose stuff. He looks for my size and everything. Where's that one? So we're trying to find cotton stretch leggings and cotton stretch capri. But they're all over the place. So they have these no muffin top leggings. I'm getting one of these black ones. Because you ladies know that we always have our little muffin top. Especially when we finish eat. So they have socks on the side. I like these footsies. They're really cute. And they have scrubs here. Anyway, Kevin just tried his jacket on, it's so cute. I think he should get it. Look at this. Kevin has this t-shirt. This is a female one, but he has the male version. Grinch. <laughs> That's funny. I have this t-shirt. I get a lot of nice t-shirts here. Oh, look how what fans. Harry Potter fans. Oh, I like this one. Life is tough, but so are you. It's 
So they actually brought all the gingerbread houses already. These are so fun to make. So recently we got an in and out um, in our neighborhood and it's only like two minutes from where we live and we haven't checked it out but we might go check it out today. We might have to go in because the drive through line is always so crazy like it goes into the mall. Um, I also live really close to our mall too. Um, but yeah, look at the drive through line, it's always so crazy. Let's see how long it is today. Well, it's actually not that bad today. Oh wait, it actually is bad. Look at where the line stops there. So we're inside, in and out now. So this is the kitchen. So got their signature vanilla milkshake. Let me open it. Their milkshakes are the best. Look at this. It's really thick and nice. So we got four double doubles animal style. And I got a milkshake. And we also got animal style fries. This is what the burger looks like. It has two patties. Um, it has cheese. I just heated up in the microwave so the cheese is melted completely. There's tomatoes, pickles, and some animal style sauce. Their sauce is so good. And then the fries also has the animal style sauce with some bacon bits. So this is a nice lunch. So we are in Costco now, we just got back from the gym and we just stopped off for some quick, um, quick groceries and just a walk around because we love Costco. So it's kind of empty, what time is it? It is 10.27. They have the ninja. KitchenAid. I just bought the KitchenAid food processor. The big one. Nutribullet. Ooh, this is good too. I have the KitchenAid version to this. Oh, this is it right here. How much we got this for him? 70. 70, yeah. It was on sale a few weeks ago. And they have the smart stick. I have the older version of this one. Induction cooking. Oh, the, the pot's not on sale anymore. If I... Oh.
my legs feel like jelly right now. I just had an intense leg workout. I have these bacon mats, they're pretty good. $15, you can't go wrong. I bought this um, pot set. It's really good. $70. Again, you can't go wrong. It's a really good price. This is your red one. So Costco does have a lot of good deals. That's why I love it. <laughs> and if you could barely hear me, it's because I talk into a mask and I'm already soft spoken. nice bowls the whole clothing section here and there goes Kevin these are convenient glass is always better this is nice yeah we actually have this one I use this to store Lots of veggies and my fruits. A knife sharpener. Strainers. Oh, this is nice. And my auntie just gave me this over the weekend. Auntie Pinky. Auntie, if you see this, thank you so much. I'm just doing a little quick walk through um, like I said I'm gonna space these videos out over this week just to show you my little grocery shopping so enjoy drinks I don't do zero sugar Kevin loves the zero sugar stuff I'm not into that this Mexican coke is really really good they wanted the glass bottle the drinks they have a whole wine section here this is really good. Do you want one of these? Yeah, John. Let me show you the wine I usually buy. When I do feel for something, I like to get this one. This cherry moscato is good. Um, there's a, this Corbel champagne is good to make mimosas. Most popular beer right now, Corona. They have bagels. Uh, six ninety nine croissants, and then this is the whole cake section: tuxedo cake, cheesecake. They have cookies here. These are really good, and then they brought all the cookies. That's different than our fruitcake and pumpkin pies are out already, $5.99. have Dungeness crabs, king crab claws, lobster deals, shrimp, Try. Chicken. I used to get these chickens, but they're um, too watery. They have a lot of water in them. So when you cook them, they just spring a lot of water and they fall apart in the pot. So I just get the H-E-B chicken now. Yeah, creme brulee. We got the flan the, the last time, right? I saw the flan in Sam's Club. It is chocolate lava. <coughs> Macadons. Oh, this one's better All than of the one. right here. This is better than the one in uh, Sands? Yeah. yeah. 
This is really, really good. Chicken pot pie soup. We have a lot of different types of quick um, meals you can pick up. This is really good, the Asian wraps. Um, their mac and cheese is good, their roasted chicken wraps are good. This is their whole fruit and veggie section. They have ginger, all the organic stuff. They have green labels. So $6.49 for ginger. Cocktail tomatoes. Let's go into the cool section. Sweet corn. This is really good, especially for corn soup. $5.99. Kevin usually picks up the spinach here for his breakfast. $3.39. All the green labels are organic. They have strawberries, blueberries, all the fruits are in here. Blackberries, grapes, um, sweet peppers, the baby ones, squash, um, cucumbers, these are English cucumbers. Cocktail cucumbers, these are really nice to snap on. They're just a bit on the expensive side. Carrots, celery, broccoli. Kevin loves broccoli, so we always have broccoli at home, whether it's frozen or fresh. French beans, Brussels sprouts, this is $6.49. $6.49. Mushrooms. I usually get my mushrooms here. Um, Baby Bella mushrooms. Apple slices. Fruit plates. Fruit bowls. Yeah. Ziploc, $13.99. These are the sandwich bags, $11.49. We got most of our um, stuff here. Let me show you those bags I got. Here's where I got them. The grocery bags, $4.97 for four bags. Last time we came, they didn't have any. Hey, hon, you want to pick up one? And they have a lot of water too. So this is the Downy Unstoppables, $14.49, pack of stuff and all. This is where I buy all my laundry detergent and my Unstoppables and dishwashing liquid. Foil is always expensive, $15. I've actually never had that. I don't remember ever having that, but this is the real stuff here. Martinelli's, I love that. I like the original one, but they have this one too. I didn't show you all, but they used to have a gopa juice and it, um, they stopped carrying it, but I bought like six bottles one time when I saw the stars, the star next to it. Wonton, shrimp. Ooh, this is really, really, really good. If you all shop at Costco, get this and add bandania to it and hot pepper. And it tastes like a broth, like a shrimp broth. Kevin didn't like the um, spring rolls, so pizza. We have cauliflower pizza, meatballs. Kevin usually gets this meatballs. Cilantro, lime burrito. The lasagna is really good too. Taquitos. This is really good too. Panaco pita, samosas, 
francs and a blanket. Mozzarella sticks. Sweet potato fries. Brazilian cheese bread. Kalachis are a thing here in Texas. These are really, really good. And they used to have blueberry muffins and they will this. They have eggs here. Kombucha. Coconut water. Suja. <clears throat> they have egg whites. Palm. This is really good but it's strong. They stopped carrying the kombucha I like. Good thing I still have a little bit from last time. This yogurt is good too. But I stopped um, using a lot of dairy. Flour tortillas, yogurt. And they have a lot of berries here. Yeah. I usually get these for my uh, smoothies. Pineapple. I usually get this one. And um, let me see. The blueberries. This one. They have high press for 89 for eight, which is a really good deal. Their eggnog is really good too. Butter. That's certified Heavy cream. I love whole milk so much, but I had to stop it. Ooh, they brought back matcha. So this is what I drink, unsweetened green tea. And it's nice to see matcha again in Costco. Should I get one? $19.99 for this pack. Matcha is pretty expensive and Costco usually has it at a really good price. I need to get this. This is amazing. I'm gonna pick up an next bag. Last time I got one and then they were out of stock and I got that. And Kevin got these wisps but I don't like them. They're not that great. Actually, looks good. This is six forty nine. So they have the UHD milk here. I usually get this almond one. I got this at the start of COVID. And I recently got this one, the milk academia. Made with macadamia nuts. This is really good too. I'm trying to show you all everything. <laughs> this is something I always pick up too. I have two bottles at home. Honey is another thing I always have, $8.99. And here they have oil, this is olive oil, 20 avocado oil, this is what I use. Grape seed oil is good too, $7.99. Vegetable oil. Mm. 
see this star it means they're gonna stop carrying this product so it means to stock up so just buy a lot if you really like it just buy a lot and then this one is my favorite coconut milk for the past month this was 6.49 and I picked up six boxes so I have 36 cans I don't need to buy for probably the next few months I also picked this up. I have a bag home. I also have this one. Bacon soda. Almond flour. This flower is good too. All the spices here, everything bagel seasoning. I'm wearing pink salt. I need to pick up one of these. This is $2.79. Cinnamon. Active dry yeast. I got this last time and I thought I would like it, but it wasn't that great. So just in case you thought about trying it. But you can try it and then let me know what you think about it. Pasta sauce. Brio is supposed to be a really good brand. This is our favorite rice here, the jasmine rice. It's $35.99. And they do have, I think, parboiled rice here too, yeah. Basmati. They have um, a lot of Asian, Asian soups and they have a lot of Asian products in this aisle. Filming red hot cookies. This is that golden um, Ness beverage. Madras lentils. So I tried this and I didn't like it. So it's best to get that um, one done soup. I'm not a fan of this chicken breast in a can. <laughs> I haven't tried this tuna yet. Um, I haven't really tried the canned fish. Pink salmon, 1338. I mean, 1389. So Costco is seeing Christmas already. It's kind of empty now. It is 11 o'clock. And this is our little haul. Didn't pick up much stuff. See them doing the pizza here. So they have planting 79 cents a pound. They have all the provisions for soup here. Cassava. Eggs. 